Right now is 6.06. Time for a bit of a reality check. This new information here in a study that was just out overnight reveals that really most of us truly underestimate heart disease and the threat it poses. And typically, we don't hear a lot about heart disease until February because that has always been heart month. But as Jesse Schultz shows us, despite the campaign to raise awareness, there are still a lot of myths out there. They say the way to the heart is through the stomach. So what better place to ask questions about heart health than the West Side Market? The Cleveland Clinic found only 32% of Americans know that heart disease is the leading cause of death in women. The most common answer? Um, I believed it was cancer. Um, breast cancer, probably. I haven't heard of a lot of women having heart disease. I've more so heard about breast cancer. Dr. Leslie Cho with the clinic says that misconception is dangerous. If you think heart disease is not a problem, then you're not going to be active about doing preventative things. Like getting your cholesterol checked. The survey shows three quarters of Americans believe they should start getting checked in their 30s or later. But only one in five knew that testing should begin in a person's 20s. And the reason is not to start people on mass medical therapy. That's not the point. The point is because heart disease is so preventable that you can really incorporate good diet and good exercise. For 24-year-old Sydney Sublet, that came as a surprise. Actually, growing up, I was never told that to get my cholesterol right. And that falls in line because the survey says awareness is the lowest among millennials. Well, my sister was 34 and had a minor heart attack at 34, so I don't think there's any age that's too young to just get tested. And as far as diet goes, there's only been really one diet that has consistently shown to lower the risks, and that's the Mediterranean diet. Only 19% of people know a diet rich in plant-based protein, good fats, fish, and little red meat can make all of the difference. And speaking of numbers, Dr. Cho says the important thing to remember is 90% of heart disease is preventable. And so by controlling your diet, controlling your risk for high blood pressure, cholesterol, diabetes, and obviously not smoking, you can really lower your risk of heart disease. In Cleveland, Jesse Schultz, News 5.